Hi, I'm Max Good, Director of Equipment Reviews and Keeper of the Flame at AmazingRibs.com. Welcome to our virtual showroom. The Art Flame. It sure is pretty. It's a piece of sculpture. And as a cooking device, it is one of the most unusual ones I've tested. It's really a big griddle that burns charcoal and wood inside the bowl. And people stand around it, guests and cook alike, and can chit chat, have some drinks. You could be on one side cooking what you like, your friend could be on the other, arguing with you about <laughs> the best way to cook it. The social aspect of this is very appealing. I had a really tough time getting used to the fire in this device. The reason being, I expect things to have some control. I expected it to be hot here and cooler here, which it was, but it can be uneven all the way around. However, I finally learned that if you just start with the premise that this is unlike any other cooker you've ever used and accept the idea that it's okay if the heat isn't exactly even. You can move things around. Say, all right, I want, I want, uh, oh, this spot right here is really hot. I'm gonna use this for some steaks. This spot's not quite as bad. Maybe I'll put a little uh, bread there to toast it. That said, it is important to get off to a good start when creating the fire. We don't normally recommend match light, but it works really well with this. You just pile a little up in the center, stack wood around it, light the match light, and as the logs burn and turn into red embers, you push them underneath the cook surface and then stack more wood and just keep going. As you cook and keep adding wood, the surface will even out considerably, but it's never going to be exact. Art Flame is not for everyone for a variety of reasons. First of all, the $2,000 price tag limits the market right off the bat. And it's not as easy as just firing up a gas grill. But there's something wonderfully impractical about Art Flame. If you could close your eyes and still cook on it, the social aspects and the aesthetic beauty would disappear and the impractical qualities would jump to the forefront. So don't close your eyes and invite your friends over and fire this beauty up. I thoroughly tested this model. If you're watching on YouTube, scroll down right under the little piggy with the red hat and click on the link to my full detailed review. For more about this and hundreds of other grills and smokers, visit AmazingRibs.com where you'll also get tested recipes, tips and techniques, and everything you need to know about outdoor cooking. AmazingRibs.com, the biggest, baddest barbecue website in the world.